Hey guys, what is up? I am Double Driven. I got Manny with me. Uh, I came up with something this morning. Uh, showed it to Manny, and he's like, "What? What is this?" <laughs> dude, this is this is madness, but I love it. You know, like, oh, dude. There's there's some decks like in other games where you could just play one card and just try to keep that thing alive and ping everything else down with what you got going on or just buff it up. I mean, people are running that Agalus deck too. But the problem with the Agalus deck is it's a uh, it's kind of like a one like if it dies, it doesn't come back. Siri comes back cuz she's the only card in the deck. Um but the idea of the deck is mostly get Siri out. I got either uh, Last Witch or Marching Orders to uh, pull it out. And then you just want to bombard your opponent with traps and damage. And you got a couple Mahaka Males to unlock it if they actually do lock Siri. Um, and then we got Yorvet's Gambit, uh, my favorite card from the PTR, to uh, pull a whole bunch of traps as well. And we also got Trial of the Grasses because Siri is a Witcher. <laughs> so uh, I'm you... already giggling, dude. I'm already giggling, dude. This deck is gonna be so bamboozled. All right, Death Wish is gonna be kind of so tough. Awesome. All right, so we got Last Wish. We still need to find our uh, marching orders. You might find it with a uh, last wish. All right. So we just played damages, huh? We don't even have any damages. No, you can just play the artifact. Or you can straight up look for it if you... There it is. There it is. We got our un we got our unlock. <coughs> so we end turn. Mhm. Mm so you think Ragnarug last turn, last round's better? Uh, if we're gonna lose round one, well, I mean, you you choose right how far this goes. Pretty much, yeah. So you can either use it round one or round three. We lock that, right? I think you can lock that recently. And we just end turn. Mm hmm. All right. That's cool, though, that she could play the traps again, man. That's huge. I didn't know she could. It's any special card. So it's double Ragnarug, double Scorch, double Yorvik's like, Gambit. Honestly, if you want to win this this round, like, you just straight up want to win it, you can uh, just do Ragnarug on, on range, and then just Ragnarug again on melee, if anything. It's insane. Well, I wouldn't do it yet, you know. I was going to say, can just... he'll just play his Death Wish units into it and get value out of it. That's the only thing. Yeah, so so right now, what would be buff, right? Just artifact buffing? We use it now, huh? Uh, I don't think so. We can do it any time. Oh, because we're behind, I see. Yeah. We can go to four, though. We can. Actually, I will, I will go to two, like one, two, with one card down. Because if we will be go ten cards on hand, and then he will get ten cards, he will become seven. Right. Yeah. And then you do Ragnarok on both lanes. <laughs> what did he just now, do? He can actually buff. Trigger an ally's death wish ability. He just used his ability, but it didn't do anything.
Why is it buffing that? Oh, because of the oh, oh, uh, the the one in the middle. Look at the guard in the middle. Oh, okay, okay. <clears throat> so we play crushing trap. Sure. Well, I mean, and then we we actually got a buff, like everything. Cause we gotta catch. Yeah, we can get it with uh, with that. So there's one trap. Yeah, this uh, I never monkeyed around with this card. It seems pretty good. Really good. Ooh, value. Yeah, that wasn't bad. So he was going to try to kill the 10 and then renew it? Maybe. But you still have, like, a... Uh, I mean, you don't have to win this part, right? No. Like I said, so... I can, we can go to four. That's where we got to stop, though. We, gotta, we can do the other artifact, then just start buffing that 10. We just got to stay within four points. I mean, trial, of the, well, trial of the grass is, oh, it boosts it to 12. So this will actually lower, huh? Yeah. Well, we could just, <clears throat> um, oh, we did it. Heal he and then, uh, uh, hang on. So do we use feelers? Because feelers is three and then plus two and then there's five. I think Feelers is better, right? Yeah. So we go here, here, and here. Alright. In turn. Just made it to that magic number. Four. Artifact. Do we think he's playing? Um... Ho, ho, oh, we don't have any mulligans, play. anyways. We're just passing. Yeah. This is the only bad part. Is if they do have the lock. Oh yeah, I honestly point. think yeah, you just won here, man. If he doesn't, if he doesn't have a lock, you won. Rock fiend. All right. Is he gonna burn a card? He's gonna burn one. Oh, we burned a Necker. That's good. We got a lock. We got a spear. We got a trap. And remember, we we deleted one trap, right? So yeah. just keep that in mind. Uh, I will start with Ragnarok on, on range. Like, just straight up. Do Ragnarok on range, then Ragnarok melee, and then from there on, the traps will actually take all the value away from him. <laughs> That's insane, dude. Just, well, we wait, right? We wait to Ragnarug, or we do it both now? Uh, the clear is only on the one range. Either way. So we just end turn. Yeah. Next, we probably play the artifact, huh? Mm, uh, we'll see. We might lock if he's like another like super crazy uh, consumption value, but um, you might do trap and put it on melee, just bamboozle him. Lock that one. Oh, he's using it already. So now we just Ragnarok both, huh? I think you can still lock the three, right? And then just Ragnarok melee. 
I would Ragnarok immediately. Ragnar 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 All right, so we got double fire going on. What year is it? <laughs> so he's losing four a turn. That's fine. Time to ping that. We ping that the one. All right. And he already used leader, dude. Oh! <laughs> Renew Gels. That's what it is. We kill it with the Trial of the Grasses. We just, yeah, we kill it with Trial. Alright. Kill it, kill it, kill your seer, kill your seer. Go Succubus. You know what I mean, right? So yeah. as long as we were... Right. I think next we just play the Serpent Trap. Well, no, we could play the Incinerating Trap. No, no I think you what, let's do the Serpent Trap first, because this way, you know, perfect. Ooh, there it goes. Don't make me laugh. And we play Serpent Trap now. Next we play our Yorvet's Gambit. Oh, I, do you play it next, or do you play it after you play it? Oh! <gasps> Oh my goodness. All right, yeah, well. Which one did you play? You play this. Right, uh, okay. Yeah. And, okay. So it's got three turns, he plays three cards. <laughs> He's gonna stack on this row and it's gonna <laughs> nuke it for four on every card. <clears throat> dude, devil, this is insanity, dude. No... Karen Thier, what's he playing? Karen Thier, there is no escape, dude. No. Um, we just play Incinerating Trap. Oh, melee, right? Yep. It does. I don't think it matters where you play them. They just, they just go. This one does have zeal too. Um, you could flip it for three. Huh. Alright. So we play uh, Filter. No, I think we just... We, look, drag drag the Dimeridium Bomb to the graveyard. What if he has... Um, what if he has a uh, thing? Frightener. Which one? Frightener, we lose. <gasps> You're right. Then we just feel her, but leave it there. Yeah, we, we should have waited one more turn on that. That's fine, though. Okay, he cannot have... Uh, so he we, cannot have... Uh, so we final. drag this? Yeah, just drag it to the grave. And that will be your turn. This way you don't... You actually choose. Okay. So we end turn. And we've got... What's he got? We did it, Manny! He got wrecked, dude! We did it, Manny. One man army Siri. Dude, insane good, dude. Full also, if I would like to point out that even if he had the Fragner, we would have won because the Ragnar broke, you know? Did we get an achievement for that? Come on, man. Play a deck with one unit in it. Come on, CDPR, hook a brother up. <laughs> Dude, that was awesome. Hey, short video for today, guys. Sorry. I, I just wanted to get this creation out to you as soon as possible. Um, Manny, you got any, but anything for the wonderful Gwent community other than one-man army series here?
get wreck nerd. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, just, uh, okay, so um, I just want to say uh, we're probably going to be doing a run with this deck, and we're probably going to be uh, upgrading it. This was a genius idea from Devil Driven, and I think that uh, it can be worked on a little bit more. Um, you know, we are working with a window of just creation. We're trying to give content to you. So if you guys play with this deck and find something better, let us know, man. Or yeah, we, yeah, yeah, suggestions. Put them in the comments, dude. We'll uh, we'll have some fun with it, dude. Uh, I'm, I, I just, I, I, I seen this card this morning, and I'm like, why don't we play this card? No, there it is, dude. Love it. Awesome. awesome and dude. what's crazy is he has Death Wish, so he's. He was able to kill his own stuff, and he still wasn't able to hang with all them artifacts, dude. I love it. Also, I would like to say one more thing, dude. If, for some reason, you're all the way to this part of the video, shout out to you. And uh, we're anti-establishment. We will always create our own decks. We will try to work with our own ideas and give you something fresh. So just make sure you hit Devil Driven with that uh, subscribe button. Awesome. I appreciate it, man. You're the man, Manny. You're, you, you're the man. That's all I got to say. But that's awesome. the video, guys. Thank you for watching. And we'll see you guys next time.